but he's connected to that man Jesus somehow. Hmm. Y'all feel that? He's connected to that man Jesus somehow because he sounds just like Jesus preaching in here. I'm going to tell you right now, hey man, they may think we're crazy. They may think we've lost our mind. But when their marriage is falling apart, they'll run and beat the door off the hinges to get in here because they know that God is going to fix that life. When they're sick in their body, I can tell you, I can't tell you the numbers of times people go to other churches that are dead at 4 o'clock in the morning. But when the doctor says you're eating with cancer or you're having a heart attack and you got to have a triple bypass, guess who they want to call? They want to call up people that are connected to God, a worshiper, somebody that can lay hold of the horns of the altar. They want somebody to have a relationship. It's not how you pray. It's what you pray. We can learn the oratory and rehearse all these fancy little prayers and never touch or change nothing. But when you pray, because you're connected to what you're praying, it's got to change. Because the God of this universe is who I'm connected to. What connects me? 